Welcome to the Modular Clubhouse. I'm Jesper, this is the Create Audio Nifty Bundle, and today we're going to be doing a deep dive on cells. Hope you guys will enjoy this. Today I'm going to be reviewing cells. Uh, I'm assuming you all saw my review on chips already, and my next video will of course be a review of the Nifty case itself. Combining the three makes up the nifty bundle of course you get some cables there as well but i'm not going to do a full review on the uh, cables that you get with the nifty bundle if you don't mind uh, but still this set cost me 266 euros so i would say that's a great value for money deal even if you disregard the modules a case for 266 euros is great if you then also get two very interesting modules with that it's a steal. So I hope you guys will enjoy this, but please keep in mind, I've only been doing this for five weeks. So if you spot any mistakes or if you've got any feedback whatsoever, please leave them in the comment section below or reach out to me directly. Again, thanks for your time. Hope you enjoy. Cheers. So there we have it, cells. So the first thing you're gonna notice is that honeycomb shaped hexagon 2d sequencer um, and of course this whole thing is touch sensitive it's capacitive so you don't need to really push on it you just can tap it to select which ones uh, you want to select this also functions as a arpeggiator as you can see the more I touch they are all start blinking after one another and if you then want to we be really fancy you can grab some coins and do it like this and have your own arpeggiator design like that just something i saw on twitter a few days ago i thought that would it was a really nice hack of the uh, cells module so how do you then traverse the actual grid here is by these two inputs one is for traversing one on that axis and this is to traverse one there so wouldn't it be great if you then had a four to one lfo or trigger sequencer nearby oh hey wait there's chips and that has exactly the thing that we need so i can just connect the slower lfo to the left one and the faster LFO to the right one. I turn up the actual depth, and there you go, we actually traverse the whole sequence. And there is, of course, a bit of a, an art to making sure that it goes all the way down because you need to sync it if you really want that. But as you can see, you can just tap it any way you want, and it is going to continue the sequence from there. So now we've got it really running in sync. First, do the right hand side, and then traverse one further down on the left hand side but what do we actually have then well let me grab my other cables that come included with the nifty bundle so let's connect that to cv there and connect this to the tune there and grab another cable from the out connect it to the out and just start to hear something there and we're going to do the same thing for tune number two so cv tune to chip two out to out beautiful <clears throat> isn't it so let's turn the, uh, the depth down and actually stop the sequence. And I'm going to disconnect chip number two from the out. And I'm just going to show you how easy it is to tune these steps. So right now I'm on step number one. And as you can hear, this is fully quantized. So I can just select the notes that I want. Select the other one.
Okay, so now we have something. So this is how you program tune number one. And the same thing, of course, applies to tune number two. So can disconnect one, connect two. You can also do that live. So just hold the tune button and just turn this. Results may vary. Okay, so as you saw, it's fully quantized. So if you want to have full control of the actual sound, hold these, and now it's in full mode, in full chromatic mode. So you can actually just go in here. And if you want to release that, So really funny, grab some coins again, and yeah, if you put your to there, um, you notice it also has gate outputs, so you connect, can connect this to your uh, drum modules as well if you want. To be honest, I like the arpeggiator much more than the sequence I just built, but uh, that's a personal thing of course. So there you have it, cells, included with the nifty bundle that comes with chips, the nifty case, and of course cells that we've just had a look at. I like it, it's a great addition to the, uh, to the nifty bundle, uh, this really allows you to get started, and to be honest, as this was probably the first thing I bought myself when I started my modular journey, this really helped. I started five weeks ago and this was one of the first things I purchased and this really helped me to learn and understand modular that much more so I would recommend this to any starter um, well join me for my next video where I'm gonna have an in-depth look at the actual nifty case and if you've got any questions tips tricks or feedback please leave them in the uh, comment section below thanks